We have new details tonight on the two teachers suing the Jackson Public School District. Both women have more than 20 years experience teaching troubled teens, but they say nothing could have prepared them for what they endured at the 4th Street Learning Center. Fox 47's Kylie Kahn sat down with them today to talk about those allegations. Threats, expletives used by students, riots, uh, punching out of windows, fights, guns, drugs. Joanna Perkin and Amy Gish have both been on medical leave for more than a year. It was my cardiologist who took me off, who told me that if I continued working in this environment, I would die of a heart attack. They taught at the 4th Street Learning Center inside the middle school at Parkside. It's an alternative school for at-risk students. Perkins says when she left, the school had no security and no social workers. It got to be uh, so horrific that I couldn't return. All of our pleas and cries fell on deaf ears. We asked for help from administration to see if we could get resources in and um, that never happened. The teachers say several of their colleagues also left the school. They're hoping this suit brings changes for the staff and students there. If they had listened to us and the ideas that we were bringing to them, um, I have a feeling there would have been a different outcome. Kylie Kahn, Fox 47 News. Perkins says she has a ways to go until she starts feeling like herself again, but she hasn't ruled out teaching again in the future. Gish, however, says she will never go back. Jackson Public Schools tells us its district policy to not comment on pending litigation. It has a little less than three weeks to respond to the lawsuit. We'll keep following this story for you.